Hello everyone, welcome back. In today's video, I will introduce you to my ChatGPT prompt, which can generate prompt for Midjourney version 5.1. This is a modified and refined version of my previous prompt and works amazingly well. This prompt has been updated with the details for Midjourney version 5 and can create stunning images as you can see. I have other prompt video for Stable Diffusion, Leonardo AI, and Adobe Firefly. If you like this video, do check out other videos as well. Before we start our video, I uh, just wanted to share one good news with you guys uh, that Midjourney uh, is giving us free trial for this weekend uh, as per their uh, tweet. So you can go ahead and try this. Uh, you can use version 5, even version 5.1. So if you go ahead down, uh, you will find few details that you know, uh, version 5.1 is available in the trial. Uh, it's yes. Let's have a look at the prompt first. Uh, the prompt is really big. And if you have seen my previous video, the prompt is very much similar to that. Uh, but it has been refined over time uh, to create stunning images and uh, it has been updated with all the version 5 and above uh, details. Okay, before you provide prompt, you must check if you have satisfied all the above criteria. If you are sure, then only provide the prompt. So it just gave uh, extra time for chat GPT to think before it provides any kind of prompt. So it has been added recently in this prompt and I can see that, you know, it works uh, much better after that. So we'll take this prompt and provide to GPT-4 model. Uh, don't try to use this with 3.5 because uh, instructions is really too much and GPT-3.5 is not able to process everything, okay? So you'll see here after providing all the details, uh, chat GPT response was, yes, I'm ready to generate prompts for mid journey AI based on the guidelines and structure. Please give me the keyword for which you want me to generate the prompt. So my first keyword was landscape scene and it has created a three uh, prompt for me uh, one of the prompt is of niji 5 so this has also been added as a part of the from prompt so it will now create a you know niji 5 earlier it was just creating uh, for niji 4 okay so now we have version 5 so let's take this prompt we'll go ahead uh, to mid journey and we'll try and give this prompt let's go ahead enter meanwhile i uh, just wanted to show you guys uh, this is one of the prompt which i was talking about uh, niji so once I gave that prompt here, I was able to generate images like this. So let's open this in a new uh, window and have a look here. So you could see here, uh, it creates a really stunning images uh, based on the given prompt. So you can see here, you know, uh, this is an oil painting of Niji version and it looks really amazing. So we had this landscape scene, a uh, serene countryside landscape with rolling hills and a small cottage, a clear blue sky, a fluffy white cloud and gentle breeze. So this is awesome, right? And it selects a camera and other details. You don't have to worry about uh, this. Uh, this prompt is really good. Uh, you can use one prompt to rule all your images. So let's open this and see. And uh, let's have a look here. This looks amazing. It doesn't look like, you know, it was created using uh, uh, AI and the prompt works really well. So let's go ahead and try something else. So one of the other prompt which I generated using, uh, this was a portrait of a beautiful African lady. So you could see that, you know, uh, it is created uh, this image. Look at the details here. These are stunning, right? Let's have a look here. Beautiful. So that's great. Uh, let's go ahead and try something else. So let's go ahead and ask to create uh, another prompt. So this time I'm giving a keyword of a girl in a spacesuit, futuristic style and sci-fi. So let's see uh, what prompts we are going to get. So our first prompt is almost ready here. That's great. Uh, so let's take this one. Uh, we'll go to mid journey and uh, give this here. Hit enter. Meanwhile, it generates image. Let's go ahead and read out uh, other two prompts. So we have another prompts imagine prompt girl in a spacesuit, a fearless female astronaut in a cutting edge spacesuit equipped with a head up display, holographic control. So there are a lot of details here. Uh, that looks great. Let's have a look at uh, other one. So I'll take all the prompt here. And we'll go ahead and generate the images and let's see uh, the different results, what we get out of this prompt. That's great. Let's take the third one and let's enter this one. So we have the result from our first prompt. Let's have a look at the images here. This looks stunning, right? Look at this. This is unbelievable. So mid journey is awesome. We all know, but, but again, you know, whatever prompt you provide based on that, it provides a result. So. I really expect, you know, this prompt to work really well. Let's have a look at other results, if it is ready or not. Look at this one. So these are, it's even amazing one. This looks so clear and crystal. Let's have a look at the third one. This. 
so this is more like a cinematic view 16 is to 9 ratio uh, but looks beautiful so that's great let's try something else so this time i'm going with a keyword of lamborghini aventador in a motion so let's see what prompt we're going to get i expect a prompt which you know we have a car moving and we have a motion captured in that so let's see if i'm able to get that or not hit enter so what i like most about this prompt is that you know with very little detail uh, you can get a lot of information about camera motion blur so yeah this we have here uh, sort with motion blur so this is what i was expecting so we have our results so let's have a look here so this one was the photorealistic version of the and this one with the you know uh, we have cyberpunk uh, style here uh, this looks really cool uh, so i generated few more prompts and one of those was about uh, Lionel messi winning uh, world cup then we have a portrait of a cyborg woman then we have a cyber woman in a battlefield then we have another one and then one was about celebrity as it suggests that you know it creates stunning images for celebrity so this is what i wanted to check and we are able to get this so so you could see here uh, we have a close-up portrait of a leonardo DiCaprio. And apart from that, we have some prompt for cyber moment. So that's all for today, guys. If you like this video, hit the like and subscribe button. Share with your friends. And you can find the prompt in the description of the video. You can take it, try and test it. If you can improve it, improve it. And you can share the details with me as well. So I'll update the details with my prompt. Thank you and see you in the next video.